Evolutions is incredible in FC Ultimate Team, and today I'm going to show you the best bronze players to evolve in the new game. For cheap and fast, reliable FC24 coins, check out MMOEXP, the link is down below, and use the code MATHD to get 5% off all of your orders. So up first guys, we have a Manchester United player to evolve in FC24. It's going to be Mino. And if this guy was back in like FIFA 12, he would have been straight away my midfielder in Bronze Beast. What a card he has got at the Golden Glow Part 2. 81 pace, 86 dribbling and 83 physical. And let me tell you guys, I've been playing a ton of FC24, obviously, but I've been mostly playing Evolutions and I'm already evolving so many cards. So any questions you have about Evolutions, feel free to comment down below. However, they are the stat upgrades. They're going from a 62 rated bronze center to CDM to a 83 rated overall. And even as welcome to Evolutions, Evolution there, guys, is mad unbelievable stats there next up we got this bronze beast here from ilkan 64 raids at the beginning of the game then though you can do golden glow part one which allows him to go from 70 dribbling to 86 absolutely monstrous stats there for ilkan from turkey but just take a look golden glow part two evolution takes him to 84 ridiculous how about bobby clark though he might be on my road to glory this week guys i need to maybe evolve his card 57 rated to 84 and look at the stats there 75 pace 78 shot 83 passing there 88 dribbling and let me tell you guys in terms of his overall stats there they're ridiculous but the cool thing about bobby clark is he actually has mo he actually has sorry some of the most upgrades to do in evolutions you can do five with him well four golden glow part one golden glow part two welcome to evolutions and relentless winger he can play as a center mid or a left wing so if you are looking for a viable option from the Premier League, he could be your guy. After Bobby Clark from Liverpool, we are going to go to the Eredivisie there, to Iqbal. Really, really lovely card there. 63 rated with his base player card. Then he goes to a 79 with Golden Glow Part 1. Then you can get a plus one upgrade to welcome to Evolutions, which already is a solid upgrade for him. But look at the 84 rated card there for Iqbal, guys. I really recommend him. 89 dribbling four-star skill moves and can play as a cam so if you guys need a great um player there from the bronze section of ultimate team and fc24 to go to an 84 rated card he could be your man really lovely card there for him he's one of my favorites to look out for actually i mean even though he's center mid or cam look at the overall stats at least 70 and then 80 on some stats at least so really amazing um, evolution there for him and honestly I think he'd be an amazing card for most teams right now we're all looking for a good cam or center mid and as a box-to-box -box player you might not find anyone better then we go to Germany though 64 rating here guys for Remberg and overall a nice bronze card you're looking for those two 70 stats when you are you know trying to do some of these um, evolutions and when you do the golden globe though part one he goes to an 80 rated card there with 84 physical 81 dribbling and then overall a nice center mid card but look at the golden globe part two and the great thing is about this it's a fun grind you get to get such a good reward to add to your team and remberg is a great addition 87 physical 84 dribbling guys ridiculous upgrades there when you evolve Remberg. Now, from Remberg, we go to an absolutely outrageous card. I could not ignore this. His name is Thompson. He's Welsh. Now, some of these players might be difficult to link, obviously, but if you can make it work, guys, it's brilliant. Even on one or two chemistry, these players could still do such a good job for you. And in game, if you didn't know these days, I believe even if you're on like zero chemistry in Ultimate Team now, when you're just building a new squad, these players on zero chemistry would not lose stats. So other, you know, other FIFAs, that would be the case. You would lose stats, now you won't. And that's why having an 84 rated player right now is amazing with those kind of stats. 83, um, sorry, 86 dribbling, not 83, 83 physicality, 82 defending, 80, 80 passing as well. 480 plus stats on an 84 rated card like that and he can play cdm that might 
be one of the best CDMs in the game right now. What a card. Now we move on to another guy by the same name, Thompson again. However, this guy is English. He's got 87 physical once you evolve his card, my friends. 84 dribbling on his card as well, guys. 82 defending and 78 pace. I'm, I'm going back on my word. I think this guy might actually have the best evolution card from a bronze card. I actually think Thompson, the second Thompson on this video, guys, could be the best. So far, though, what are you thinking of these evolutions? Are you guys going to go and evolve any of these cards? Let me know. Now, there are some things to know, by the way. Some of these cards are actually extinct because people have started to realize, even early on, that these evolutions are going to be ridiculous. Mino, I think, is the most rare card to unlock. And the cool thing is about having an 84 rated evolution card is that people are going to see that and that's going to strike fear into your opponent's mind ahead of playing them. It's a bit like having an icon in their team or, you know, a mega team right now. Early on, people are going to be like, damn, this guy's been grinding the hell out of FC24 with these evolution cards. But Thompson, an absolute must do, guys, if you can. Comment down below as well. Do you guys wish you could do maybe multiple evolutions at the same time? Let me know. That's maybe an upgrade for the future if EA listening. Next up, though, got a really cool German card here again. This is going to be all right here with a really lovely addition to evolutions here and very good at cam center mid or even left mid with the addition of pace there he does go from a 61 rated base card to an 82 overall not as high as the other cards but if you take a look at the stats close up there they're incredible and with dribbling being so important this guy's using the left stick on your controller it's so vital to have a good dribble of the ball 81 pace 88 dribbling 77 physical cam as well and overall a lovely lovely upgrade he also has a golden glow part one there as well welcome to evolutions then the golden glow part two also guys let me know in the comments which card do you want to evolve even if it's not based around stats maybe you're plymouth argyle fan or you know a trammy rovers fan which player do you want to evolve the most do let me know obviously i'm focusing on mo mainly center mid these are i believe the biggest upgrades we can do with bronze players now on to the final selection of players here guys it's going to be vena another difficult player to link but i'm just saying he might have the best evolution card in terms of in-game stats i think he might do with those 78 pace which previously was 72 pace 80 shot which is previously 61, 77 passing, which is previously 60. He had 67 dribbling, 62 defending, and 70 physical in game. That boosts and jumps up to 86 dribbling, guys. I mean, that's a 19 plus upgrade there for him. 80 defending and 85 physical is ridiculous. Not the best skill moves a week for granted, but look at those stats. As a box to box center mid, you might not find a better center mid right now with evolution. That is unbelievably good. And a right wing, by the way, I forgot to mention that. He can play as a right wing. Bit of a tip, guys, when you do these evolutions, make sure you do your research in terms of what positions they play. That might, that might, sorry, affect your choice. It really might do. If he was like a center mid and center back, then that would be unreal, right? Look at those types of center back. So always do your research ahead of doing these evolutions. However, hopefully, guys, have a very special day. I'm going to continue my evolution right now of this legend. Have a very lovely day in FC24, and I'll see you guys on the next big video.